Aqui do meu lado, Laurent Mathieu, do Inspector Clouseau, uma banda que veio tocar aqui no Lollapalooza de 2019. Eles são da França, mas eles cantam em inglês. Encontrei com eles aqui no hotel, vocês estão vendo aqui um cenário meio diferente. Nós vamos falar inglês aqui, se você não sabe falar inglês, não sabe ler, liga a legenda aqui, não fica me xingando, tem uns botõezinhos aqui, fuça aqui que você vai encontrar a legenda. First, Lollapalooza is a, a festival not just for big bands, but also to introduce new bands to, uh, to our, our public. And you are here in Brazil, I think, for the very first time? Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, how, is the, how is the importance of playing Lollapalooza here in Brazil for you guys? But, well, it's a very good exposure, as you said, to uh, uh, the audience, because it's big. So for us, we'll, we'll make a show uh, like you haven't seen before, we hope. And so that new uh, Inspector Clouseau fan can listen to us and come to the show, because we don't want just to play once. We try to play the proper place, like Lola Palooza, to come back then and build something uh, like a long story. Something very interesting about you is that you make a kind of uh, farmer hawk. You, you, you are musicians, but you also make money growing things, selling. Is that, is that right? Not exactly. It's, <laughs> we are professional organic farmers who sell the music. It's a, it's a decision, it's a conviction, because cool. we, we uh, the band is working, we, we could be, we could not be farmer. We chose to add that to our calendar, our schedule, because we uh, agree with the, all the strikes we, against the climate and everything, but we need to find solutions too. Cool. So, and we more makers than talkers, so we like, okay, the, for us the main thing is to plant things and to feed yourself. So we earn money like this, we don't spend money, cool. we earn money, you save more. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. You save. and healthy things too. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, and we're selling one thing, is uh, geese product because we were uh, growing and raising geese. But you know, when I heard that you are, a, you have a farm and uh, you are growing things, I thought, okay, maybe th their music, it's, uh, it's more soft, but then I, I listen to your music and it's pretty happy, huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like life, you know, you're not like on the same mood every time. And For us, uh, it's rock and roll. It's a rock music because it's a blues music too. It's like a Mississippi stuff and everything. So, but we're doing our own way. But we keep the same rules, and the same rules is like pff, no, because rock without that, it's not rock, you know. Mm -hmm. yeah, so, uh, and you are a duo. Why be a duo? <laughs> Why don't? Uh, it's easy. Mm -hmm. We are. Uh, we're not a duo because of of the white stripes or the black keys mm -hmm. and. We haven't thought, you know, the music like that. It's just because uh, we had a band before, the Inspector Clouseau with Laurent. We've been playing together for 25 years. 20 years, quite a long time. Mm -hmm. And at the end of the first band, we wanted to keep on playing oh, music. We say, okay, let's make this band, uh, the Inspector Clouseau, but only two of us. Mm -hmm. And we didn't want to bring more people because we saw how it was, you know, how complicated it was, and especially with the best <laughs> player because we changed four times and that's why we wrote the song Fuck the Best Player, which is a hit now and also the name of the record label. <laughs> and so we said, and we say, okay, we play all the music with our four hands, no computers behind, nothing, because we want to play organic music, you know, feelings to feelings with people. And uh, so we close our eyes and say, oh, okay, we'll, we're going to try to make people think we're not two. And that's the challenge of the Inspector Clouseau. I've just watched one of your concerts on YouTube and you have some effects, uh, distortion, but nothing big. Yeah. Big, yeah. yeah. No. What, what do you use? Uh, my hands. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> strings, I mean, <laughs> strings and guitar, <laughs> guitar strings. And no, it's, it's like this because it's, mm -hmm. it's, it, should, it should stay as simple as, as we can to make blues because if you make, if you arrive with a big stack and everything, it's, it's not blues music anyway, it needs to be simple. Less is more. It's just reverb, faster, whoa, whoa. 
Oh. It's just color because I'm use different tuning like in in blues things. Mm -hmm. So I, I do the bass uh, in my playing. So I'm not really I would say playing guitar and playing bass and guitar. A kind of simple bass. It's like a tune kit, tune kit, tune, and then it's a tune kit, tune kit. Which tune do you use? It's my regular tune. Mm -hmm. It's a D, double D flat. Correct. <laughs> so it's like a D bemol, like Neil Young and D, mm -hmm. and then so I will have the seventh chord. And, and most of the time, at the end of the song, if you see the show, mm -hmm. I do it. Well, now it's a joke. I'm doing always like, and then you know, I'm detuning. And then I change one string, and with one string, strings, I could change completely my open. And then I change and over tuning. Cool. And I change the guitar and over tuning. Mm -hmm. And uh, and people don't understand that, of course. But we offering them different harmonies, different. But we still do. So changing oh. the tune make part of the show. Yeah, it's really important. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, changing the notes. <laughs> and you, it, your your drum, your set, it's very uh, uh, clean. I mean, you don't use a tone, just a, a floor tone, two cymbals, a hi hat. That's and it. Why is it? Cool. Because as he said, less is more. Mm -hmm. You just have to to be um, and to play what you have to play, and not like to have uh, ten toms, unless you are like. Um, uh, I don't know. Uh, you play uh, music, you know, notes on your tones, mm -hmm. very precise, mm -hmm. like Terry Bojo, for example. It makes sense. Other than that, for the music we play, you can play kick, snare, hi hat, one cymbal. Is it the sound, the big sound, is not coming from uh, materials. Mm -hmm. It's coming from the harmonies and the song. Yeah. <laughs> I love songs that there is, is rhythm, but I can't remember the last song that the, the vocal was whistling. Okay. And it's very cool. Uh, uh, again? Mm -hmm. it, I know that you have other songs that you are using. Yeah. Yeah, 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 because again, mm -hmm. we only two, mm -hmm. but we need another melodies, but we cannot, this melody cannot be uh, done by another musicians because we only two. So we need to find whistling, it's like, you could do what you want, and in the middle you could play whistling in the middle, and you have like a. It's avoiding rating some chords or whatever, and you have the, contre melodies, you know, mm -hmm. and uh, this is why we're doing a lot of whistling, but I could make some harmonica or whatever. But a whistling is cool because it's really flexible and you, it's the, the voice in fact, so it's really flexible and you could do whatever you want. To the people that don't know your music, your your songs which one your preferred your <laughs> we won't say our favorite song but if you want to hear a little bit of what is the inspector Clouseau you should try a man outstanding in his field I agree hey I know a guy he got himself a small farm yeah wife and kids few cows pigs and chickens yeah Hey guys, thank you very much. Very nice to meet you. Muito obrigado. Yeah, yeah, thank you, thank you. You're welcome. Yeah. Cara, o som dos caras é muito legal, eu recomendo, escutem. Vou deixar aqui na tela o link pro canal deles. Já tem também na tela um outro vídeo pra vocês assistirem aqui do canal e o link pra vocês se inscreverem no Música Fácil. Até a próxima. Can take a farmer out of the country. Yeah. But you can't take the country out of the farmer. No way, man.